before coming on. It's our Friday. Getting ready for the game Friday. What do you think you have to do yourself? Uh, just work hard every day in practice. Just listen to what Coach Cal has to say. Uh, continue to get extra work in after practice. Just working on my shot and stuff like that. Kyle, you've hit a slide before where it wasn't going great for you, and you know Cal was kind of hard on you, and you, you dug yourself out of that, got on a nice roll. How do you how do you do that again? And, and what did you do during that time to sort of fix things? Uh, just work extra hard and practice, just bring in intensity, and then uh, also just getting extra work in. And that's what I've been trying to do. So. Has this worn on you a little bit, Kyle? This this slump here near the end of the season. Uh, no, I mean we're we're excited to still be playing with a lot of teams that aren't. So uh, we're excited to be here in this moment, and uh, we just want to take one game at a time and, and just get it, keep improving. In the middle of a sort of slump, you win SEC Six Man of the Year. Does that sort of remind you that it hasn't been all bad? That you know that, that you can still you know play well in this league? Yeah, definitely. I mean, uh, I just gotta stay confident, and that's what I've been doing in practice every day. It's just not worrying about that. That's that's in the past. So just, just worry about the future and just keep working hard. Now you you know what it's like to play in this SEC tournament game after game after game. What do you think these freshmen are in for? I mean, it's, it's pretty grueling, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of basketball in, in a short amount of time. Just uh, we just need to worry about improving as a team and, and staying confident and uh, kind of getting better and building momentum for the next time. You think you guys are up to it to make a big run? Uh, most definitely. Uh, guys have been showing uh, great work ethic in practice and just uh, listening to Coach Cal and, and I think we're ready. Kyle, who, who would you say, who is Alex Poitras? Is he as much, as much a mystery to you guys, his teammates, as he is to, to some of us sort of watching from the outside? Yeah, he's a great guy. He's a hard worker. Uh, he's just got to stay stay confident, just like me, and just keep working hard and practice every day. What, what kind of difference does he make when, you know, Cal talks about his beast mode? You know, when he's in that, how different of a team are you guys? Uh, we're a lot better team. I mean, each player, when they're at their best, it improves our team, so... Uh, he can definitely be a beast, and we just need him to keep keep improving. Now, the, the Alex that we saw against Florida, how close is that to how good he can really be? Because you guys play against him every day. Yeah, he can be he can be amazing. And, uh, we just got to get him just playing like that every minute of the game. So uh, if he's going to improve like that, and each player improves, we can be a, a lot better team. I thought you might have already answered this, but how you doing with your little slump you're going through and trying to break out of it, that kind of thing? I'm doing fine. I mean, I don't think of it as a slump. I just come every day, the same mentality, just working hard and getting extra work in to build my confidence. How important is this? You just not think that there's such a thing as a slump? No. I just come every day and practice, play the game I love, and uh, work hard every day. How important is the defensive part of it? Cal said, you know, I don't, I don't care how many shots he misses if he just defends and plays hard and gets rebounds. Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's extremely important because even if I'm not making shots, I can stay in the games. So just, uh, I've been working hard every day in practice, just, uh, just focusing down on it and building my confidence.